Rahman Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. Today we will learn estimating probabilities 16.4. Now, question number one is a survey of a 40 car on a particular length of a road showed that there are 14 that 14 were speeding. Out of 40 cars, there are 14 that were speeding. So, what is the probability that the next car will be speeding? So, 14 divided by 40 so you will get your answer as you can see here now 14 divided by 40 so you will get your answer 0 0.35 so here is your answer you also see 0 0.35 or 35 percent each so 100 not speeding so 100 minus 0 0.35 so you will get your answer that is 0 0.65 next question as it is same so let's study read question number three miss petal goes to work by car each day sometimes she has to stop at the set of a traffic light in the past 25 working days she has had to stop 16 times find the experimental probability that she will have to stop at the light tomorrow means out of 25 days 16 times she stopped his car. So what is the probability? Let's check Here. Now 16 out of 25 So the probability should be 64. Let's check Here is 64 percent. Okay, so the experiment that uh, mental probability that she will not have to stop is 100 minus uh, <coughs> 64 so you will get your answer <coughs> like 0 0.36 as uh, same as it is these are all questions you are, you are solving now the last question now a bag contain one white ball one black ball and some red balls so use the result here are the results she does this 50 times is uh, by take out one ball out of record the color and replace it she does this 50 times by you record his result in the table so here is the result of the table so use the result of the experiment to estimate the probability of picking each of the three colors so what is the probability that the probability of picking of each of three colors so first you are finding the probability of all color like 6 divided by 50 so you will get your answer like uh, 6 divided by 50 so I will get an answer 12 percent so next time 8 divided by 50 so I will get an answer 16 percent and 36 divided by 50 so I will get 72 percent let's check either we are right or wrong a part 12 16 and 72 b part if there are three red balls calculate the probability of each color if you have three red balls okay out of uh, five why five because one is white and one is black so three plus two five so three divided by five so you will get your answer so that is uh, 60 percent okay so 60 percent is red ball so one divided by five so that is also 20 percent and 20 percent other okay so next is as it is same now here he said that if you have a five red balls so five plus two seven so five divided by seven you will get your answer 71 percentage so with the help of this you can easily find the remaining answer like 71 percent is this and other is one divided by as it is same seven so you will get your answer and uh, uh, both are one divided by so it's equal to 14 and 14 percentage now the here is also a 14 percent black and white is also a 14 percent because both are one one okay and red is five balls as it is same you are solving if you have seven red balls seven and one is black and one is white so total ball are nine seven divided by nine so you will get your answer 78 percent so if you divide seven and you have nine balls so it's equal to 78 percentage 
and if you put 1 by 9 and uh, so it's equal to 11 and 1 by 9 white it's also 1 by 11 so which probability so here with the help of this we are finding now the last part should be that if you have uh, there are odd numbers means here is 3 is also odd 5 is also and 7 is also odd so which is most likely so i think five red, red balls are most likely because we see we just theoretically solve this so we understand all the step what uh, like five ball so it is very closest to experimental ones